Hey there, I am Chris Palmer, and in today's video, what I'd like to share with you is a absolutely phenomenal Google Business Profile SEO tool, and I'm going to walk you through some of the features of it, and I'm not promoting it, I'm just sharing it with you, because it's a tool that I utilize, and once it actually went down, I realized, wow, I really wish that tool would come back online. And it finally has. So what I want to give you right now is the full walkthrough of the Plepper.com Chrome SEO extension that you can utilize to get a plethora of information for your Google business profiles. So, of course, I don't want to waste too much time. Let's go ahead and get through this. What Plepper is, and I'll go ahead and share this with you. If you come on over here, you see this little... Uh, box right here and I know that there's some tools out there that do some of the functionality or maybe all of the functionality I'm not sure but none of them quite did it like this tool here you know it's giving me the place ID the CID it's giving me the actual categories the business profile ID shares with me the address phone number website reviews ratings image counts the actual coordinates and the knowledge graph ID it goes into the profile and gives me every single one of the URLs that I utilize to manipulate, to send traffic to or through in order to get a boost for the listing. It gives it all, it gives me all the information at the click of a button. And all you're gonna have to do is head on over. If you were using Plepper previously and it stopped working, I'm gonna walk you through how you can go and get it. All right. So here's what you have to do. All right, so first and foremost, go to plepper.com and create an account. All right, now I'm not affiliated. I'm not promoting it. The tool's free. It's completely free, okay? It's just a great tool. So head on over to Plepper, create an account, and then what you'll be able to do then is up here in the Chrome lists, you'll see the Chrome list tool. See, new version of Plepper Chrome extension with export and lists functionality see this so once you create a free account completely free you click on this button right here and what it's going to do is it's actually going to give you a download of a zip file as you can see here i just went out and got this here's the zip file now if you're using pc this is going to be the instruction i have no idea if you're using mac or any other type of machine but for windows once you download the chrome extension you right click and then you extract all once you've extracted all, another file will be created. As you can see here, the extraction file is created. It will be marked 2.0.2, all right? Now, once that's done, you head on over to your Google Chrome account. If you're using Chrome, I assume you are if you want a Chrome extension, right? And what you're going to need to do is simply this. Up here in your right-hand corner, see this little puzzle piece here? Click that puzzle piece and then click on manage extensions. The very next step that you will need to do is click this button here, load unpacked. But before you do that, what you need to do is turn on developer mode. So see this button in your top right hand corner over here? It's called developer mode. Turn developer mode on, okay? And then click on load unpacked. And you know that file that you extracted from the download? that says 2.0.2, click that and upload it. Or you could just drag and drop it into here, but it needs to be the extracted file. Once you're completed doing that, you will actually have, you'll have access again to the Plepper functionality, this awesome tool set. You'll be able to get all the links, all the attributes, everything that you need and love about using Plepper. It's back, it's easy to use. This is how you get it on your system. This is how you utilize it. My name's Chris Palmer. If you have any future questions related to Google Business, Google Business Profiles, SEO, pretty much anything at all, never hesitate. Feel free. Go ahead and ask in the section below. And I always look forward to seeing you in the next Google Business Profile SEO Tools video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.